ask that you be present with us and move through us and allow us to lead your people who are deeply into your heart this day. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Marching out to freedom. So it was 40 years ago and what the, the pastor of the time, Pastor John Steinbrook and the leaders discovered was that there were people who were dying um, in the cold and there was a, a group of people who were trying to figure out what to do about that and that was a day when there weren't a whole lot of homeless services um, or shelters and so this congregation decided that it would make a move and um, by word of mouth opened up the sanctuary one evening and had 200 people who came in over the first few days. So um, just a real sense of need and then from that um, gained also a sense of wisdom and finding who are the most vulnerable of all the people who are homeless and um, they settled on women. And that's sort of the trajectory they've been traveling for the last 40 years. The early years were a lot of this congregation really having to act out in love because the first places for people to sleep were here in the church, in the sanctuary, and then as it went to be uh, really ministry with women, um, women would be sleeping in the hallways, in the chapel. And when I talk to some of the elders, um, I think that I really am humbled to hear that a lot of them you know, would come and fix dinner you know, five nights a week. That was, they'd go to work and then come here and fix dinner and feed now the dozens of women that were living in the church. Homelessness still exists. In fact, um, when I um, talk with the leaders of industry, now yeah, the pressures on industry to expand services are astounding. Um, a lot of the uh, economic situations that we're in now are people who have good educations who become unemployed or perhaps have become ill, have lost insurance, have lost jobs, have lost homes. So there's a huge range in the, the life stories of women who come through industry. that it's really incumbent upon the church to um, stay awake and pay attention to that. Yes. 